Let's go over the three-point stance offensively. Three things you need to remember to any offensive stance is it's not cookie cutter. Everybody's stance is unique. It's what makes you move. It's what allows you to have the most power. But you must be, most importantly, comfortable in it. Three things to remember. Your base, posture, and your head. Let's start with our base. Base is referring to our footwork. All right, our feet need to be set hip width to shoulder width apart. Some of us might be a little bit more narrow, some of us might be a little bit wider. Again, we need to be comfortable, all right? Second is our posture. Our posture wants to be up nice and tall, big, proud chest. We don't want to be rounded over. Last thing to speak about is our head. Is our head upright? Can we see what we're about to block and hit? So when it comes to our base, we have a right side of the line and a left side of the line. Important to know what side you're playing on because you will need to be in a left-handed stance or a right-handed stance. Now, right now, for the sake of this video, this bag here is our center. I'm the left guard. I'm gonna have what you call a right post foot. Post foot is my closest foot towards the center. That foot's gonna be up on the heels of the center. And from there, I'll now set up my base. I'm gonna have my left foot out anywhere from hip width to shoulder width apart. It could be slightly pointed outwards, it could be upfield. Again, where you're comfortable and you're gonna have the most power and balance with your first step. All right, from here, I now wanna talk about posture. Is my posture rounded? Right, or is it nice and straight? Biggest way to fix our posture is we're gonna take our shoulders and pull them back. Big, proud chest. All right, from here, we're gonna just drop into bit of a squat. Next thing we want to pay attention to with our posture and our base is are we square to the line of scrimmage? Some of us will set up and we're going to be here. And then I might tell you to turn your pocket in, turn it forward. The moment I do that, I now square up to the line of scrimmage. Last thing we'll discuss is our head. Is our head upright so we can see what we're gonna hit and block. Now I'm on the right side of the line. I need to be in a right-handed stance. That means I have a left post foot, foot closest toward the center. My feet are hip width to shoulder width apart. Shoulder blades pulled back. But a drop into a stance. The crook in my elbow should be right over my knee. Shouldn't be lower. If I start getting a gap or a break here, my ass is too low. Right here. From here, I'm now gonna drop into my stance. Shoulders are back, sink in, pocket forward, hands in the dirt. I should have my ear drop right on top of my hand. I don't have weight forward, I don't have weight back, I keep my weight consistent. Same thing if on the left side of the line, right-handed stance for the right side, left-handed stance for the left side, right foot forward, that's my post foot, hip width apart, shoulders back, drop into that stance. Eyes up, see what I'm able to